Welcome on this uh, four leg flight, first to Munich, the after to Warsaw. Um, this is my colleague, senior first officer, Sonny Brandley, and my name is Lukas Berger. Oh, clearance limit is over to yeah. left side clear, right side clear. As you can see, we don't, we do not really need uh, to advance the thrust levers uh, in order to get the aircraft moving. Idle power is enough, basically, to get started with the aircraft. Line one, great sea, proceed uh, east of uh, ILS one four towards threshold three two. Uh, ILS one four, threshold three four, line one, that's it. Threshold 3 2. On runway 2 8. Clip take off. Your control. Your control. Modernizing reported and uh, light to modern turbulence from ground until uh, flight level 110. Mm -hmm. Then otherwise no auto land possible, gusty winds, visibility is over 10 kilometers, light showers of rain, a few clouds at 1300 feet and broken towering cumulus at 2205 degrees. QNH is 1016. We uh, think the runway might be still wet from uh, some rain showers in between. Uh, winds, mean wind is uh, the worst case is 310 with 17, that means a little bit from the right side, but quite strong wind. We do not add to here the gust wind. Temperature 5 degrees, QNH 1016, and uh, for gusty weather we always lose flaps 5, not flaps full. Uh, we we think we might uh, some catch up some ice, and uh, otherwise, it's going to be a cat one. It's going to be a cat one approach, normal approach, not a steep approach. We can use the thrust reverser. The performance penalty is here a polite, mel applied. It means just one thrust reverser is an operative. Checklist. People landing checklist, landing gear down, down slap lap, five set, five set before landing checklist completed. Approaching minimum. Minimum. And continue. Check. 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 Check.
clear to land. Pilot. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Take off. Can you take off? Fly level 200 set checked. So that's it. We, uh, we did our best. <laughs> it was not good enough. <laughs> I guess he was a really bit uh, surprised about our uh, good climb rate. <laughs> yeah. It's impressive. It's really impressive. The thing, the thing with the aircraft is, um, you know, initially after takeoff it climbs. I would say more or less with a normal climb of rate and then we have thrust reduction and that is quite uh, misleading uh, because with, uh, we have a, a very high derated thrust rating and even flex takeoff at takeoff and when we reduce actually the thrust it, it reduces the thrust a little bit and then actually uh, gives more thrust than our palm takeoff that leads and you know, of course clean no flaps leads them to quite high uh, rate of climb in our case between 4,500 and 5,000 feet per minute which is more substantially one thousand stabilized verified so So on three, keep proceeding C series. The runway, the wind is two five zero degrees one zero knots. Runway one four, clear to land. Runway one four, clear to land. This one on three, keep proceeding. Clear to land. Runway one four, crosswind to the right. Crosswind to the right. Five hundred. Checked. Checked. Approaching minimums. Minimums. Continue. Two. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Once again, good morning, morning. dear cabin crew, uh, for the second part of our uh, video rotation. Uh, now we go to uh, Warsaw in Poland. Um, the aircraft, we are sitting already in our sights, Alpha Zulu Alpha. Uh, a special thing though for you, senior cabin attendants, um, a special PA announcement for uh, this flight concerning the coronavirus. Flaps to set. 
checked. All clearing the received received after start checklist. After start checklist, ground equipment removed. Sled flap two set. Fly control checked. After start checklist completed. Thank you. Before take off checklist. Take off. Okay, land line for force. So it's one one three uniform great CB and company line up on way two other way beyond. Approaching two eight. So it's one one three uniform great two way beyond your company line up on way two other way Before take off checklist the brakes temperature on way two eight beyond. Check uh, ICOS. Take off configuration checked. Before take off checklist completed checked. LM9 for Fox for contact departure. Goodbye. Goodbye. On runway two eight. So it's one three four eight. Wind two six degrees nine knots. Gusting up to one five. Runway two eight. Clear for takeoff. Runway two eight. Clear for takeoff. West one three four eight. Clear for takeoff. Head change. Engine engine takeoff. Runway two eight. Clear for takeoff. Runway two eight. Clear for Knots checked. V one rotate. Positive weight. Gear up. So it's uh, 1348, contact departure, are they? Contact departure, are they? So it's 1348. Three departure, it's 1348, passing 2200, climbing 5000 feet. So John 1348, direct departure, good uh, mid dog identified, climb to flat level 120. Climb to flat level 120, so it's 1348. 1 2000 feet set, checked. Gauge okay, auto pilot. On the uh, PFD, the primary flight display, uh, we have the uh, synthetic vision system which uh, displays the terrain actually below. Once we are approaching onto a runway uh, or turn towards the runway, you can also see the um, the runway in the distance and uh, like something like an uh, extended center line, which uh, of course in a uh, cloudy situation uh, or in an instrument. IMC situation uh, helps you to align with the runway. That is for sure one of the most obvious uh, differences uh, between uh, the E1 and E2 jet. Approaching one one. Run inside straight ahead. 500. Inside. Checked. Checked. Autopilot off. Autopilot. Autopilot. Approaching minimums. Minimums. Continue. One hundred, fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, ten. Breaking. Clear for takeoff, 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 clear
Inox checked. We won. Rotate. Positive rate. Gear up. Yeah, welcome back again on the flight deck of the E2. We are now already uh, reached our cruising altitude of uh, 38,000 feet or 11,600 meters above sea level. We are now currently um, north of the city of uh, Prague. Our routing continues via Nuremberg, Stuttgart and then more or less a straight in approach in runway 14 direction Zurich. Um, at the moment we are traveling with an indicated airspeed of Mach 0.78. Actual ground speed is uh, 443 knots at the moment. We have uh, yeah, more or less a strong crosswind from the right, about 80 knots. And um, yeah, a few words about the flight mode and simulation panel. At the moment, we are on, on the altitude hold mode, so the autopilot uh, remains the current altitude. LNF means we're following uh, our uh, routing. Autopilot and auto throttle are engaged, and uh, speed is on thrust. Then on the MFD, you can see here our routing. I'm the pilot flying right now and uh, I have the weather on my side and uh, Lucas normally has the terrain mode active. Here you can see our next uh, waypoint, uh, distance and estimate time of arrival and the remaining fuel at that point and as well the destination to runway 14 about the 304 nautical miles to go and flight time approximately from now 45 uh, minutes and landing fuel about uh, 3.3 tons before landing checklist landing checklist landing gear down down slap flap five set five set before landing checklist completed So, autopilot coming off. Checked. So. Autopilot. autopilot. 1000 stabilized. Verified. One thousand five hundred meters remaining. Good. Bye controls. One thousand two hundred remaining. So this uh, was it from our side. Thank you very much for flying with uh, Helvetic today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and uh, you could learn something. We enjoyed it and yeah, hope to see you again on our flights. Thank you and goodbye.